integration, definite integrals. If we integrate between a and b of f dash x in terms of x, we're going to write it in this notation that we get our integral f of x, but we're putting it in square brackets and we're keeping the limits the same, so b at the top, a at the bottom. And what we're going to do is we're going to substitute in the b into the function that we've created and take away substitute in the a into the function we've created. An example just to illustrate this. If we integrate between 1 and 2 of 2x in terms of x, well if we integrate 2x that gives us x squared, add 1 to the power divided by the new power, and that's going to be between 1 and 2. And so the next stage that we're going to do is we're going to sub in our 2, so we get 2 squared, 4, take away, sub in the 1, 1 squared, which is 1. So 4 take away 1 is 3. So the integral between 1 and 2 of 2x in terms of x is 3. A few more examples. Integrate between minus 1 and 2. 3x minus 1 multiplied by x plus 1 in terms of x. Well, what we've learned is we can't do anything with that until we multiply it out. So we're going to multiply it out. We're going to get 3x squared plus 2x minus 1. We integrate that. Add 1 to the power divided by the new power. Gives us x cubed plus x squared minus x. And that's between minus 1 and 2. So that gives us 8 plus 4 minus 2. All take away minus 1 plus 1 plus 1. So that tells us 12 minus 2, 10, take away 1. So that integral is just going to be 9. Integrate between 1 and 3, 1 over x squared in terms of x. Remember, we need to write it in its index form, so we need to write it as x to the minus 2. Add 1 to the power divided by the new power. So I get x to the minus 1 over minus 1. It's easier to substitute things in if I write it in its other form. So I'm going to write that as the minus can come up to the top and the x to the minus 1 is just a 1 over x. So that's the same as minus 1 over x. That's between 1 and 3. So sub in the 3, I get minus a third. Sub in the 1, minus 1. So minus a third minus minus 1 is 1 minus a third. So that's 2 thirds. Thank you.